remember this one? Oh, yeah! This shot was taken right before we won the race. <laughs> we were the best. Now, now, now. You certainly do have a vivid imagination. Our team beat you by a nose, if I remember correctly. Right at the finish line. <laughs> hmm. That's Aldo. Remember? He came to hide out in our house. There were some geese chasing him, weren't there? And they were really scary. Don't be silly. You have to keep up with the times, Ancinia. You'll see. With this mixture I've invented, I'll bet my radishes will taste a lot better than yours. Hmm. Do you really think I'm going to take your gardening advice? You were knee-high to a grasshopper when I helped you plant your first carrot. Hmm. Why can't we ever go outside when it's going to rain? Snails go out in the rain, don't they? I'm so bored. You moved in. I saw you. You moved in. You are the worst. I am the best. You are the worst. I am the best. Uh-uh. It was the wind. Dandelion, what are you doing? Look outside. Daddy and Antonia are arguing. Sounds like it's about the radishes yeah. this time. Yeah? They just had an argument yesterday about the turnips. You know there. I think you can lend a hand. My book is leaking. She doesn't want to use the fertilizer that Daddy and I invented. Oh, I don't like it when they argue. Oh. Don't worry, Dandelion. Arguments happen sometimes. It's normal. Even people who love each other can argue. Yeah. Huh? Your aunt and I are going over to the Baxters. We have to help them fix their roof. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We'll be back at the end of the day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Daddy, mm -hmm. are you going to make up with Ancinia? Of course we will. Even adults get into arguments once in a while. And if your aunt wasn't so stubborn... I'm not the stubborn one around here. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be good, Daddy. <laughs> See you later. I'm not stubborn at all. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. I'm just realistic. Miracle fertilizer. Honestly. I'm telling you, we'll have a much better crop. We have to help them get along again. You must be joking. What are we supposed to do? This is adult stuff. Do you remember what Mom used to say? Um, no. What? Music soothes the savage beast. We're not beasts. Are we? Uh, no. Music puts you in a better mood. And they could use that right now. Oh, yeah, it's true. Like, when Daddy plays his trumpet, it always makes me want to dance. <laughs> and have a good time. <laughs> That's it. Let's give them a concert when they get home. Good idea. After that, they'll never have another fight again. Come on, let's get our instruments. <laughs>
together at all. Huh? Huh? Mistletoe, we're giving a classical concert. Put those flower pots away. They're not flower pots, they're congas. And you know what, Mr. Know-it-all? Hmm. With Dandelion on maracas hmm. and Violet on guitar, we're gonna make our own group. Go ahead. You three can make noise, and Periwinkle and I will play real music without you. Hmm. That's great. This way we won't hurt our ears with all your racket. Ha! <laughs> Our group's gonna be way better than his. You can say that again. We have to find a name for the group. What do you think of the salsa bunny? <laughs> <laughs> no way. Noisy bunnies is more like it. He's really getting on my nerves. <laughs> Ah, is anyone here? Well, that depends. Let me introduce myself. I am Aldo Trebleclap, musician on the run. On the run? Why are you on the run? There are two big geese chasing me, and I don't even know why. I moved into their village, and then all of a sudden, they stopped liking me. Just like that, uh -huh. for no reason. Aldo, would you look at that? You found some musicians. <laughs> That's how it works. And if you like, I can stay here and give you a few lessons. That goes for you, too. No, thank you. We're fine without you. Will we want a lesson? Yeah, please stay, Mr. Alto. Ready, please? Alto? Alto? You shouldn't make promises you can't keep. I left my instrument in the geese's village, and I can't give you lessons without it. Well? Just go back. And give those horrible birds a chance to catch me again? I don't even want to think about it. Don't worry. You'll be able to teach us because we're going to get your instrument back from those geese. Yeah! What? Uh -huh. There's no way I'm going there. Especially to help someone I don't know. Uh, don't move. We'll be right back. What's the matter with you, Paul? Where are we going? I think he's nice. Ah, uh, Alta. Do you feel that gentle breeze? Smell that wonderful smell? You're finally free, Alda. You're finally free. I'm telling you, that rabbit is a thief. It's as plain as the nose on your face. Huh? Do you know any thieves who give music lessons? It's a trick. And in any case, if he wants his instrument back, he can get it without me. If Daddy were here, I'm sure he'd want to help. Huh? Well, it doesn't matter, because we don't all have to go. You three can do it. Good idea. Huh? Oh. That way, we can watch him. Mr. Elbow! Yes? Violet, Mistletoe, and I are going to go get your instrument. Thank you very much, kids. I'm sure you won't regret it. <laughs> oh. The village is a few yards up on the right. Remember what Aldo told me. We have to be as quiet as we can. Oh, this is it. Shh. We go into the workshop. We take the instrument back, and then we're out of here. No one will ever know we were here. Aldo, why don't you have something to eat? I think you've earned it. What did I tell you then? Not only is he suspicious, but he has no manners. Yeah. 
but listen. One thing's for sure. He does know how to play. What does that prove? Well, uh... Believe me, if those geese followed him this far, he must have done something bad. Something very, very bad. Why don't we just ask him? You never know. Maybe he'll tell us exactly what he did. No. I think I have a better way. Just leave it to me. So, what do you see? Hurry up. It's full of dust. And... Is that you? No, Treble Clef, the one man band who has captured our hearts. Captured our hearts? That's funny. Someone <laughs> <laughs> around here has a crush on Aldo. You were right. Uh, if we can't get to Aldo, then we'll get Aldo to come to us. Just as I thought. He has a map of the area. Hurry up. Come on. I'm scared. <sighs> he has everything a thief would have here. Look at this. You must have taken it from someone. Here. Ha! Well, what would he need that for? Isn't it obvious? He uses it to pick locks and get into people's homes. Oh. There's nothing like uh. a snack and a concert to oh. cheer up a one-man band uh. like myself. Hurry up! He's coming! Uh. Wait! Uh. What's this? We're telling the truth. truth. We don't we know don't who know he is. Well, then why did you come here to get his instrument? Well, because... Because we're musicians. And our dream is to have our own band someday. Right, guys? These kids are stubborn. How can we get them to talk? We have all the time in the world. Maybe a night in the workshop will jog their memories. Oh. Have a good night. You little musicians! <laughs> I want to go back home. I want Daddy and Aunt Tinia. <laughs> Why don't we just tell them where all woe is? Because it's not nice to tell on a friend. We'll find a way out of this, I promise you. Mm. Don't worry, Dandelion. It'll be all right. <sighs> I don't believe it. To be a way to get out of here. I've got an idea. One, two, three, four. Huh? That's impossible. Did you read this? Wow! That's unbelievable. I never would have imagined it. Uh, who would have thought? Uh, uh. Hello. Did you find what you were looking for? Huh? <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
playing my music. The problem is, fans from all over the countryside became obsessed with me. And now they follow me wherever <laughs> I go asking for my autograph. I can't go anywhere without being followed. You mean all those geese are looking for you because they like you? Absolutely. And right when you got here, Aldo was imitating a fan. Look, <laughs> it's a letter from a turkey. Aldo, <laughs> my love. <laughs> oh, you thought you were a thief. I'm a victim of my own success. You should see them after a concert. Aldo Treble Clef, don't go. Please sing us a song, sing us a song. Huh? They have the place surrounded. Now what are we gonna do? I'll leave by the back door. Huh? Wait a second, Aldo. I have a better idea. They want a song, right? Well, let's give them a song. Are gone. Yay! Yay! Ha! You know what? 
Sometimes it's best to do your worst. <laughs> you play badly? You must be joking. It sounded all right to me. It was an interesting mix of salsa and classical. With a little practice, I think you'll sound really good together. Would you allow your humble servant to turn you into stars for a night? My newfangled fertilizer isn't bad after all. Huh? Maybe I was a little too stubborn about that. You know something? I'd like you to teach me how to make your little mixture. It might come in handy. <laughs> <laughs> Would a newfangled nephew be willing to give me this dance? With pleasure, Anzinia. ready to perform anywhere you'd like. No way! I don't want to have crazy fans like yours, Al! 